Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to talk about bringing audio into frame. Uh, as a musician, this is a topic very dear to my heart, so let's dive into it. So to bring audio into your frame, you can do uh, add to this frame, or you can add the asset to your inventory, uh, if you'd like to have it here for easy use in the future. I'll go ahead and add something to my inventory, I'll do add audio. Um, it will let you, for now, pick an mp3 file. So I'm going to go ahead and grab one. Let's grab this one here. It will take a second or two to load. And then now that I've added it to my inventory, I can see it in here. And then to add it in the scene, just press the green plus button. Now when audio comes into the scene, it shows up as this small little sphere. You can turn edit mode on to um, scale it up if you want. And then you'll see the media controls uh, right down there below it. Um, you've got play, stop, and then mute or unmute. And I'll go ahead and just start playing this. You'll see the sphere starts to sort of pulse a little bit if it's playing. And worth noting that if someone were to join this frame right now, uh, it would actually catch them up to where uh, the audio is for me and start playing it for them so that we'd be pretty much synchronized. And if I pause it, it will pause for everyone. And then if I play it, it will play for everyone as well. Down at the bottom left, uh, when you click on the asset in edit mode, you'll see the edit menu shows up. And there are two special options for audio. You can toggle whether it's positional or not. And positional means it's louder if you're closer to it. And in fact, it even has a stereo effect if, you, if it's to your left or to your right. If you've got headphones in, you'll hear it louder in your left or right ear. But you can turn that off if you'd like it to be uh, sort of equal volume for everyone in the frame, no matter where they're located in the frame. Okay, And then you can also set whether you'd like the, uh, the audio file to loop or not. All right, there you have it. That's pretty much it for audio. Thanks for checking out this video, and you can get started at framebr.io. Thank you.